I will say, see any change? Any major change? More buildings? Okay, that's it. There's a private hospital here. It's called Paitilla. Shadiran was brought there in 1981, but it was too late. His cancer was too advanced. And this is Royal Radish of the Capitalist. This one also be belongs to the Cameron. And the one building outside Royal the Capitalist is called Megapolis. And then another one will be called Panapolis. And then, I mean, all of them are police. But there are a lot of hotels. This is uh, multi-central. They're building another road above this. Multi-central for shopping. We have other centers too for shopping. And here it starts the Balboa Avenue. And this is the highway. You came last year, this was not here. You see, this is for ease of traffic. This is going to go directly to the Samaritan's Bridge. So we can avoid the traffic here. It's going to be ready, they say. Uh, it's going to be ready in, uh, in three days. Yeah. That being 2009. Pretty soon we'll be going to be going uh, on to Balboa, where all the new construction, where they're widening the road. Well, traffic is a good moment to observe the different cars or vehicles we have here. Chevrolet, Ford's, Datsun. Oh, that's a Datsun. That's very old. Datsun does not traffic any more cars. It's Nissan. And this is where Noriega was hiding back in 1990. This is the Vatican Embassy here to the left. You can see the flag, yellow and white color. Noriega was hiding there. I mean, was hiding there. He was uh, where, uh, he was uh, dressed as a priest and. Uh, Noriega was running away. Then the Americans call and they say, anybody who knows about Noriega, there's one million dollar on bounty. The new infrastructure that's Shortly after they announced that somebody called from the Vatican Embassy said Noriega's here. Now you understand why the priest went to Spain, bought a new car, and, here we and are bought now a new we're house. getting to where you can see the ocean. He collected money, the priest. And because where they're building the... Okay, uh, now this is a project, I mean government project, it's called Sita Costera, this is new also. They're going to build here hotels, restaurants, cafes, gift shops, souvenir shops. They can, even they're going to bring clean beach, I mean clean sand, the so tourists and Panamanians can swim here. It's a new road that they're winding. It's a big project here. It's going to cost only, for us taxpayers, $189 million. Of course, when they finish, they say, oops, sorry, it's with this thing, it's $250 million. But that's that it. Point of that's uh, you can see where the breaker that's wall to is. Make more All that's going to be that's road. Why they're building here. It's going to widen this more, road. It's going to be twice as wide. A lot of cafes, restaurants. They're going to take uh, actually 35 hectares from the beach, from the I mean from Panama Bay to build all this. And a lot of the Spanish companies have been buying all these lands to build.